the story should be that Sting hand chose the Young Bucks and the arrogant Young Bucks, rather than be thankful, they they go down the road of, yeah, of course you chose us, bro, because you wanted the rub on the way out. Yeah. You, you know, it's so easy. It's so simple. All right. So speaking of psychology, uh, Sting and Darby Allen, ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, new tag team champions uh, with Sting and Darby Allen. And uh, hey, man, they are really strapping the rocket on Sting and with his uh, retirement tour. Now he is the one part of the tag team champions and they're really um, they're really going full steam ahead with this Sting and Darby Allen versus Young Bucks thing. They're even putting in a title with it now. So EC3 is someone uh, who's a, also a big Sting fan. Uh, what are your thoughts on this uh, this tag team finale of yeah. Sting's career teaming with Darby Allen? Should he have had the tag team titles leading to their last match? And do you think that last match is the match that uh, is the right decision? It's not for me to decide whether he should have the tag titles or not, but I think, and maybe the fans could comment below on this because this is what it's really about. Does him having the tag titles in this final run mean anything to you? Like, did you garner a reaction that, yeah, that's awesome, I'm so happy? Or was it just a prop being traded for the sake of adding more to a story that in theory probably doesn't need it? I think the legacy and the legend of him is enough, but I, I can't tell you the right decision. I can just tell you, did it make people feel something? If so, then perhaps it's the right decision. But if it's just a title change for the sake of a title change to gussy up something that's already, you know, pretty real and pretty significant, seems unnecessary. Yeah. What do you think, Vince? No, he's 100% correct, bro. This is all about Sting and Sting's last match. You don't need a freaking tag titles involved in this thing. Put the tag titles on somebody that need it, bro. You 1,000% do not need it here, which 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 was not on Raju's list. Let me add some to Raju's list. Come on. Here's what I'm looking forward to, Chris. Here's what I'm looking. This story is going to be bigger than the Vinnie Mac story. Ooh. We got Booker of the Year coming up, bro. Like any day now, any day. What happens if Tony Khan does not win Booker of the Year? That's what I want to talk about, bro. EC3s, uh, he books uh, Exodus now. Yeah, man. Yeah. Fantastic, Booker, dude. Maybe I mean, he can be uh, a nominee. I have, no, I mean, the, the stuff hasn't been seen yet because I'm squirrel holding all the content to release it properly in a very significant way but dude i'm great at it man I, every person on an exodus show the nwa exodus has a reason has a point has a why and whether they win whether they lose both parties get over in the conclusion of it i like learn from the best nice. Al Snow and vince russo so you know i, I don't think i'll be in on the um maybe maybe next year yeah, hey, uh, let me ask you something, um, Chris. Who did they beat for the tag team? The tag team? I'm just curious. Ricky yeah. Starks and uh, Big Bill. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Bill Morrissey. Yep. Uh, if, if you saw it, how did Sting react? A, a bit uh, anticlimactic, actually. That's what I thought. Because yeah. like, it didn't mean anything to him. He's probably like, I don't need these. Yeah, yeah, and not only that, Chris, but like, see, this is what Tony Khan doesn't understand. And this is, you know, what EC3 is running his own promotion and he understands this. Bro, you're going to have winners and losers, yeah. but you got to protect everybody. Sure. You yeah. got to protect everybody. So that's that's the question I would ask. OK, bro, you 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 put the titles on Sting and Albie, uh, uh, Darby, which you absolutely do not need because the story is it's Sting's last match. So yeah. now. You took the titles off of these two AEW guys. What did you do to protect them? So by moving the titles over to Sting and Darby Allen, it's not just a case of the, these titles don't need to be a part of this program. It's also a case of now how much did you hurt those two guys? Sure. Yep. You know, and then like the the young bucks attack Sting's son. How old is he? 
but well, both of their son, both things, both sons, uh, two sons. They're in. I think they're in their like late twenties, early thirties now. And they're well, they go super kick them at the Publix or something. Bro, I hate. I hate to tell you too. So I know Sting's kids are like football plays and stuff. Yeah. They probably could take the young bucks, bro. Like with, with all due respect, I know Sting's got some big kids, man. Yeah. I mean, to me, and this is my personal opinion and mine alone. To me, that just seems unbelievable well the fact like the reality of the situation is sting has his last match he wants to wrestle the young bucks why doesn't sting and darby just tag against the young bucks and we don't have to play like are the young bucks really going to attack his family on the way out like yeah. Yeah. it's implausible and it adds no heat it's just kind of confusion where the real emotion of the moment is this legend is going to pass the torch to these guys in the way he wants to do it. Like Shawn Michaels versus Ric Flair. I don't think Shawn went and poisoned his family's like. I beat up Ric Flair's kid, though. Uh, Reed, whatever. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah I, I beat him up. Yeah, you beat up Ric Flair, too, actually. I mean, like, it's, the story sells itself that all these bells and whistles are just gaga. I, I, you're dead on, bro, because the story should be that Sting hand chose the Young Bucks. And the arrogant young bucks, rather than be thankful, they they go down the road of yeah. Of course you chose us, bro, because you wanted the rub on the way out. Yeah, you, you, you know it's so easy. It's so simple, bro. So complicated. Yeah, yeah, man. Everything awesome. is everything is so freaking complicated, bro. <laughs> Going back to the what what happened tonight, Chris. Yeah. That's what we were talking about on the other show. Absolutely. What when did things become so complicated? Yeah. Yeah, man. I mean, it's just uh, trying to incite the pop and trying to keep the chaos going because that's what the fans like, man. They like the chaos nowadays, and you're going to have to – you're allowing the uh, inmates to run the asylum. Man. They don't like the chaos. Though. They'll like what you, you give them if you give them something real and tangible. We can Theoretically, that. that's true. But a lot of these fans nowadays, they are uh, so bloodthirsty and they don't they have the attention span of a hiccup and they don't they don't even want that. You and know, then if, that's the case, if that's the case, they have no attention span. When this match happens, are they going to remember the Young Bucks attack Sting's family? And really no, they're, they're not. not. They're not. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Say, hey, this is the way it's going to go down. This is what... Oh, the guy who's earned his own way out wants to do it. Yep. And here are these, you know, two young uh, little jerks who are going to, you know, I need the rub on the way out. You want the rub from us on the way out. That's cool, man. Yep. Like I like that. And how does that work, bro? If, if it's Sting's last match and now they got the tag team titles, does that mean they're doing a job in Sting's last match? Probably so. They're probably, they probably will... No, I think Sting and Darby will still win. I don't think the Young Bucks is going to. But be then they'll the still have the belts, and Sting retires with the belt. You got to grab one of his sons at that point. <laughs> <laughs> I, bro, I don't, I don't understand this stuff anymore, bro. I, you put the belts on him, so now Sting's having his last match. So but you, you either, you beat, you, either you beat Sting or Sting yeah, retires you, yeah, with, yeah. The, with the tag team champion. Yeah, yeah and the championships goes out with Sting. <laughs> Yeah, but you already know Tony Khan, man. He'll have a he'll have a tournament. He'll have a sixteen yes, man yes, tournament to, yes, to, yes. to determine the second person of the Yeah, team. that's gonna be Darby's right. partner. Yeah. That's or or cool. either who's ranked the highest. Oh, there you go. Yes. Are the, are the tag teams ranked or is it gonna be the you know, well we're gonna put number seven and number nine against number three and number six Probably so. Yeah, Battle Bowl style, which would be kind of cool. Yeah. 